This seems to be like a very elementary uh, tip for Windows, uh, and it applies to all versions of Windows, going back to even Windows 95, which I doubt anyone's still operating, and if they are, you should throw away your computer. But um, the reason I'm doing a quick video tutorial on this is because I'm shocked at how often I encounter uh, looking at, a lot, because I do look at a lot of people's computers. I, I'm at clients' offices all the time, and I, more often than I would hope or expect to see, I see that this option is, um, is not sort of changed. And what I'm talking about is locking the taskbar at the bottom of your screen, and by unlocking it, it opens up all kinds of doors and windows of opportunity for you to do fascinating things with the taskbar. And that's what this next webcast is designed to show you, so stay tuned. Stay tuned. Hi, Seth David here from the world famous Nerd Enterprises Incorporated. And this is a very short tip, uh, Windows tip that I want to show you. If you focus down here on your taskbar, which most people have it here at the bottom, you may have noticed on many of my webcasts where I do any kind of screen capture that mine is all the way on the left. And you might be wondering, well, how do I do that? And the first trick is you have to right click anywhere here on the taskbar. This is called your taskbar because it has your tasks. Now in Windows 7, which is what I'm running here, it uh, gives you the opportunity to dock icons. There used to be a quick launch toolbar which this kind of replaces. In any case, you're going to right click here and you see here where it says lock the taskbar. Many people have this checked off, which makes it uh, impossible to do anything with the taskbar. Uh, it, it keeps it locked as it suggests. So what you want to do is you want to right click here and click on it so that it unlocks the taskbar. Now assuming you like the taskbar on the bottom, which most people do, and maybe it's just because they didn't even realize they had a choice there, but you could actually expand this, make it bigger, and what I like about that right away is that on the right here now you can see the whole date. Now the other thing I like, which as I pointed out, you may have noticed, is I prefer to have it on the left. I just think it's easier and it gives me, I don't know, I just like it better. It's my own personal preference. I can't give you a specific reason why it's better. It's not going to be better for you if you don't like it better. But you can also put it on the top, maybe like that. You can put it on the right. I just moved it off to my second screen there. So. There's lots of flexibility, like I said in the precursor to this. It opens up all kinds of doors for new and wonderful opportunities and things you can do with the taskbar once you've unlocked it. So go ahead, take that leap and unlock your taskbar. Do it today.